What is common between a car, a ship, a battle tank, railway, power plant, huge building and large bridge? They are all made from a small pellet produced at SR Steel. So, how is it that such a small pellet is made into a super strong steel? Well, it all starts here, at the iron ore mines. What looks like mud is actually the rich iron ore deposit. Iron ore and fines are excavated from these deposits and brought to our beneficiation plants at Bailadilla and Dabuna. Here, the fines are beneficiated to enrich its iron content and transported in the form of slurry to pellet plants at Vishakapatnam and Paradeep through the world's second largest pipeline that runs for more than 500 kilometers collectively. Once at the pellet plant, the slurry is processed to make high quality pellets. From the pellet plant, the pellets are then transported to Hazira, our steel making facility via ships. As they arrive at Hazira, the pellets are unloaded by large cranes onto conveyor belts and are either moved to the storage bay or fed into DRI, Corex and BF furnaces for iron making. These pellets are then reduced through chemical process which involves reaction with reformed natural gas, limestone, coal or coke to produce molten iron or DRI. The liquid iron is processed through the electric arc furnace and cone arc to achieve the desired quality of steel. In this process, undesirable elements like aluminium, silicon and magnesium are removed by way of slag. The liquid steel is then taken up for refining in the ladle furnace. At this stage, ferroalloys are added to the liquid steel to achieve the desired chemistry. Some of the steel grades require additional processing in the form of vacuum or RHT gassing to achieve clean steel with low sulphur, phosphorus, nitrogen and hydrogen. The refined liquid steel is then tapped through the tundish into the continuous slab casters. The slabs are conditioned, if warranted by the grade or application, for which it is rolled into a finished product. The slabs are reheated and then fed into the rolling mills to yield a variety of finished products, which are hot rolled coils and hot rolled plates. Hot rolled coils are further processed into sheets, skin passed, pickled and oiled, cold rolled, batch annealed, galvanized, color coated, etc. Depending on customer requirements. On readiness of the finished product, the steel is shipped directly to the customers. So be it for infrastructure, automotive, white goods, yellow goods, shipbuilding, power plants, or defense industry. Our steel is used in a variety of applications. And it all starts with a pellet. SR Steel, a name to reckon with in the steel industry.